All right, so we got another beautiful track. We're gonna be here at Hawks Landing in Orlando, Kissimmee area. Um, I'm already seeing a lot of water. So it's gonna be, uh, we'll see, a little wind, a little water. We might get a little bit of a challenge today, but I'm excited. We're gonna be uh, tooling around a little bit with the shot scope again, right, Mike? That's right, we're gonna fire these bad boys up. Yeah, so maybe we can even have like a little side competition. Yeah, man. Maybe longest that. drive today. Okay, let's do that. Maybe who can w win the most medals? Most medals, most greens. Most, yeah. Let's put everyone to work today. Let's see, let's see what those stats wrap up. Cause this, like I said, it's gonna be doing all those stats in the background while we play. GPS watch while we're out there. So I'm excited. It's finally got warm. The sun's on our face. It's 72 degrees. Oh, yeah, you know what? Let's get Let's it. do it. Let's go. All right, so we're going to start it off here on a nice par four. Starter just gave us a little bit of insight on the course. It does not roll at all. He said basically the ball's just gonna stop. Uh, but we're gonna play the uh, the greens, which are about 6250, 6300. Uh, the tips are way back around 67, so I don't know, that's a little too much for us. Right? So, yeah, no, we can do that, yeah. Let's jump off here. I'm ready to go. And he said, since there's no rolls, lift clean in place today. And what do you say, the uh, the bunkers are seven days old. Yeah, they're brand new. All brand new bunkers, all brand new sand. So he said, it hasn't settled yet, pick it clean. Perfect. I have enough trouble with bunkers that are yeah. 100 years old. I know, I know, exactly. <laughs> we'll Let's see. see how we do it. All right, Mike, take us out. Let's do it. Shot scope loaded up. Playing at 363 yards here. You got through. Yep. You got through. Good ball. All right, left side. Left side of the fairway. We're Let's off. do it. There's a fairway hit already. Uh oh. Love it. I'm in trouble. Jump start. Finish strong here. Good strike. Go ball. You got a green. GIR. Go ball, go. Caught a piece. Stick with Dan. And that's how you recover from jail. <laughs> Woo! Baby. That was a scrappy par save. Woo. What do you see on this birdie putt? Oh, these, are, these are quick, man. They're quick. I really thought I saw a break left, you know, left to right. All right, I'll take it. All right, might as well quickly talk about pin collect. So look, stand over the hole. What that does is it GPS tags the exact location of that hole. So I know all my putting statistics, how many feet I putt, as well as my approaches, my proximity to the hole, because otherwise it would just be guessing on the green, like to the center, or whatever. But with this, I know the exact location of the pin that day, and all my stats are accurate. All right, I got 35 to the middle, but this wind is stiff. I'd honestly play it about 50. Okay. All right. All right. It's gonna work out in your favor. Keep it good. I hate to tell you, dude, there are fried eggs, and then there are craters. <laughs> yeah, we hope and pray here. What do I even do? How do I hit you just it? gotta. They said it's soft. You just gotta splash that out. <laughs> hey, check out who just caught up with us. So we got Eric Benzenberg. You guys saw on, him guys. on played in Bally Owen, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Eric does some reviews for Golficity. 
And then we got Chris McEwen who is joining us in a second. If you guys haven't seen his McEwen Reviews It segment, it's awesome. In fact, he did a great uh, breakdown of the shot scope a little while back now. That's right, yeah. We'll link to that video so you guys can check it out because uh, Chris really talks about the details about how, to, how the system works and stuff, so check it out. All right, now we're foursome. You ready? Let's do it. So the sixth hole, I parted. I think I played it really well. Uh, it was a short par five, just under 500 yards. I got a nice booming drive all the way out there. The wind was at my back. I had about 160 left in with some wind. I tried to take a little bit off with a nine iron. Ended up flying it a little over the green, but ended up putting it really close. Missed the birdie putt, but made it with a par. So green and regulation. I missed the fairway, but it was still long. But I ended up with a par. Couldn't be happier with that. It was a good hole. Let's see if we can keep it going here. I'd say that's pretty accurate. What do you think? It's pretty spot on. All right, although it's not playing long, Hawks is certainly proving to be quite a test out here. Lots of water, lots of hazard, lots of, lots of sand. Uh, but the wind, I think the wind has been the hardest part today. Um, it's a gusty wind and it just, you feel like you gotta keep everything low, which is not my favorite trajectory, that's for sure. But um, it's fun, it's a nice track, but it's been a challenge today, no doubt. All right, number 11, another thinking man's hole here where you have to set yourself up off the tee to give yourself a shot at that tricky little, almost an island green, I wanna call it. Not quite an island, but surrounded mostly by water. So this is gonna be a little bit of a challenging one, um, but that's what Hawks Landing has been today, and even more so with this win. But it's fun, it makes you think your way around the course a bit. Man, this is tough. I thought I did the right play, put it in the middle of the fairway off the tee, I laid up with the iron, but I left myself too much going in because I hit that wall of wind again. So now I've got 190. I got 190, again, straight into the face of the wind to hit that, that little green out there. Yeah, you can do it, let's do it. You hit that so good too. Just a little right, catch a little of that trap. Yep, I think I caught that right bunker. You're good. <laughs> Guys, we just found, we just found Chubbs or whatever. <laughs> that gator has a ball. Can't even zoom in far enough. Right on his tail. Right there. <laughs> What's the ruling here? Wait for him to move? That's funny. It just rested on him. He don't care. This ball now. Oh, good try. Unfortunately, I thought I caught that bunker. Looks like it one hopped that water, so I didn't get away with it. Hit that penalty button on the shot scope? Penalty. Done. Hey, you think you can take that aggressive line? I think I'm gonna try it. What's the carry? What's like the, the, the tip carry? Safe zone, 261. There is not a big landing zone there. That is a dangerous play. Did you, did Here's, you? Oh, let's just, this is the smart play. <laughs> this is the mic play. Let's go. <laughs> No way to play golf, by the way. I'm gonna aim straight down the water. <laughs> okay, John Daly. And we no, no, we're gonna let my my golf problems take it to the fairway. You ready? 
Cracker would have a nightmare with that. Yep. That's when it works. <laughs> Okay. Play your game. <laughs> that green got me. Three putt. Hate the three putt. Well, uh, learn from it and move on. Chris, we'll put you on the spot. Yeah. All right, so you're a shot scope converter. You're a yeah. user. What's your favorite feature? I, ooh. I know it's a lot. It's tough, right? So my favorite thing, I don't know if you call it a feature, but they constantly improve that thing over and over again for free all the time. Mm -hmm. I can't tell you, and I was a, I'm not just a uh, converter, I was a discoverer. That's I right. used the V1. Yeah. And even back then they were making upgrades to it. So I just think the V2 stuff they keep adding, like think about when it came out, didn't have metals, didn't have the new options on there to, uh, to track your putting differently, all these new upgrades it's coming out with. That's probably my favorite thing. It just oh. keeps getting better. I bought it once, but it's feel, it keeps feeling like a new product. That's great. Know? Yeah. I forgot he was a V1 guy. He was a V1 guy. He was a V1 guy. V1 guy, guys? OG. Favorite feature? I like that the watch lets you browse the different hazards. Uh huh. So, like, if you don't see the full hold, you can see waters up there. There's some bunkers, what the carry distances are, the front side, the back side, and that way you know exactly how to you know strategize the hole and everything. Yeah, that's legit. GPS and stat tracking all in one device. Gotta love it. Alright, Frank's got a nice little chip shot here. Short guy today. That looks oh. good. I'm going know. 60 degree. I choked up a 60? Lot. I'm going 60 <laughs> degree. <here. laughs> <laughs> All right, if you reach with that 60, I'm giving up. Yeah. It's gonna make it rain with this. Yeah. It might be the club. No way. Right. It might be the club. Oh, it's all, oh my god. <laughs> and he's the back of the green. Woo. All right, put it to about, what do you say, about six feet? Yeah, probably. With the 60 degree wedge. Take it back up a little bit. Yeah, put a little spin from the Vokies. Popped it. Put it back. We're gonna make a bird now. Right. Yeah. Where are we on that one, huh? Yeah, you're fired. <laughs> you're fired. <laughs> Good bird there. Hey, thanks, man. <laughs> Feels good. I gotta tell you, I was wrong. You were yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. You were right, 60. <laughs> You're fired. All right, we're on 15 here. We're about to wrap it up for the day. We're gonna have some fun. We got a short par three. We're gonna play a little closest. What do you say, boys? Yeah, All right. All right. And I don't know what the prize is. At this point, we're so exhausted, we don't really care. It's a cup yeah. of coffee. Cup of coffee. All right. Yeah. Let's do this thing. Good bends. He's going. Looks good. Okay. All right, floor. he's dancing. He is dancing. Be enough, be enough. Go, 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 go. Oh, okay. I walk that out. All right, the verdict is in. Eric got it. You know, tough one with the water. He had Chris over here, and we went a little bit long here. So, he wins the coffee and the bragging rights. All right, we got a brutal closing hole here, 500, 545 yards, and check out this tee shot. Saved it. Saved it for 18. Let's do another 18. <laughs> Swing. 
Well, if they put us any further back, we'd be on Route 417. Rush hour ball. It has not been around for the record books. Tough round, tough course, pretty course. Um, a lot of fun, I'm glad we got a chance to play at Hawks Landing. Um, tell you what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back, we're gonna sync up these shot scopes, you do it via Bluetooth to the app, download these stats, and look at the tail of the tape. Yeah. We're gonna see who had uh, more greens, more fairways, all those important stats. So, I don't know, you got any early predictions? I think you got me. Fairways, maybe. Fairways, yeah. You might have got me on greens, but we're going to see. We'll see. We'll see. So we'll take a look at this. I feel like at least I putt well today. You did. Didn't you did do putt. a lot of other stuff well, but I putt well because the wind does not a factor when you're putting. But anyway, fun time. Guys, go check out the shot scope because we love using it for these reasons. And you've got that whole replay of your entire round, which you can look back on at any time. So check it out. Thanks for following along. We'll see you guys again.